to welcome this morning. That's a, it's what a wonderful time. I love it when we've been inviting new people to come. Some have been here for a while and some are new, and we would, I'm just thankful to the Lord for this morning. Um, and I want to welcome any visitors we have here. Thank you for being here with us. There's two things we ask of you. Number one, in, in the seat in front of you, there's a card, and we'd like you to fill it out, let us know you've been here, and put it in the offering plate. But also on that card, there's a section for a prayer request. And we would love it if you have prayer needs that you would fill that out. We have an intercessory team that what we delight in doing is praying for you and asking God to move in power in your, in your life. We like it when Jesus wins over and over again, and we like to have the opportunity to pray for you. So please do that for us. And also, after, uh, after the service today, there's going to be a luncheon. Uh, we're welcoming the new members and, and for our, our bishop and his wife, Meg. Meg? <laughs> hey, Meg. <laughs> um, so please, please plan to stay. We're having lunch. It's uh, right after the service. And, and we're asking that, um, because I have been informed that nobody's going to eat until the bishop and I get back there, so do not dally. <laughs> so, um, I want to welcome our new members this morning as well. I, I am so delighted that you're here with us. Um, this, um, I've been telling this for a couple of weeks now, but also there's still plenty of Advent devotionals that are out in the narthex. They come from Trinity School for Ministry, and they're, they're daily devotionals during the season of Advent, and they're free. So we ask you to take one or take one for someone that you like in your family if you'd like to. This Tuesday, every first Tuesday of every month, we have a day of prayer and fasting, and that's this Tuesday. What we're praying for is asking God to move in our midst, but asking God also to pour out His Spirit upon this nation. We need revival. We need the hearts of, of God's people to be reunited and just kindled once more. We have boldness in, in the gospel message, and so where we pray on, uh, and fast on Tuesdays, first Tuesday of every month. And then on Wednesday, we gather every Wednesday, uh, and we have since January from 11 to 12. We come together to pray and, and ask the Lord to move in our midst, to change our hearts, to give us a heart for our community, to let us see them through His eyes and have His heart for them. So we invite you to come. It's a wonderful time, and it's kind of really growing in, in our unity. So if you could be here at 11 o'clock on, on Wednesday mornings, we ask you to, uh, to come. And, and kind of the kickoff to that is that at 12, there's lunch. And it's a good lunch. It's not like peanut butter sandwiches. So we ask you to come and fellowship with us at that time as well. Uh, there are going to be prayer ministers after the service up here. If you, if you have prayer needs, we invite you to come. We'd love to pray for you today. Next Sunday, right after the service, is going to be an, the annual meeting of our congregation. And so we invite everyone to come. And then right afterwards, we'll, we're going to do what we do best. We're going to have lunch. <laughs> so we invite you to come and, for that time as well. Any birthdays and anniversaries? Well, already then. Pray for the offering. Father, we thank you that you have so freely given to us, that you have spared nothing, Lord, and most importantly, you have given us your Son. And so, Lord, we come as an act of worship and of thanksgiving. We return a portion to you, and we thank you in the name of Jesus. Amen.